Tatsu Masuda, welcome to WPC Television. You are an energy expert from Japan and also chairman of Faircourt Capital in London. But I want to ask you not about energy and climate change, but about Japan, mm -hmm. which hasn't figured in the mm -hmm. conference so far. Yes. What are the prospects for Japan as, as you see them? The short term and long term are quite different. Short term, because of the prospect for the Tokyo Olympic Games in 2020, there's some hope something gonna, good thing may happen. Could be illusion, but what, why not? And longer term, there is a heavy burden of uh, national debt, which is accumulating minutes by minutes, which is heavy on the mind of business players, household, and everywhere. And uh, but the debt is owned by by the government. By the government, and it's in well the over two hundred percent of GDP, higher than Greece. But uh, with even with this debt we are still alive because most of it is held by Japanese nationally, roughly 24, 94%. But the longer term, people's worry is what would happen if government cannot hold this debt? There could be an inflation that will slim the any saving of people. And last point of uh, heavy feeling is pension. Pension fund are supposed to support life after retirement, but because of slimming of uh, pension funds and aging population and more retired people, pension is slimming year after year and people are worried, how can I support my life after 10 years from now? And younger generation feel, are there any pensions left for us? So the bottom line is that there are going to be some big political challenges. Yes for the politicians of Japan. Tatsuma Suda, thank you very much. What, just a final question. I mean, you come here quite often to the World Policy Conference. Yes. Uh, what benefit does it give to you? It's extremely broad scope of views from wider perspectives. This is very unique and really appreciated. Well, thank you for your here. participation. Thank you, Tatsuma. Thank you very much.